Yo, tubers, what's good, man? I haven't talked to y'all in a long time as far as the vlogs go. Everybody's been saying they want me to vlog again, man. I've recently been in a couple, featured in a couple of YC Imogen's vlogs. I don't know if y'all know YC Imogen, but you can go down in the description and click on a link to go to his YouTube and check him out. He's a cool vlogger, music video director, all of the above, whatever. That's my boy, man. We grew up together, so. I've been recently featured in his vlogs, and everybody's like, yo, vlog again, vlog again. Yo, you need a vlog again, blah, 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 blah. We wanna see what you've been up to. Yo, well, here you, here you see it, man. I got a messy house. Messy living room. Nah, I'm just kidding. It's just toys all around, man. I got this wide open. I keep it simple in here and let him run around while daddy gets the work done. I've just been doing music videos, man. Doing a lot of music videos, traveling. I go back and forth to Virginia a lot because that's where I'm from, my hometown. That's where my mom is. That's where my grandma, my granddad, my uncles. That's where my little teeny, teeny family is, man. They're in Virginia. So I always go up there a lot, man. I always miss them. Oh, what you say? You miss them too? You miss them too? I think you're hungry. I think we need to go get something to eat, man. What you want to do? Huh? Huh? <laughs> you want to go get something to eat? You hungry? No, don't you do it. So I was up all night to like 6 a.m., man. I was finishing up a video, a dope video by two artists in uh, Connecticut. Was I on key? And uh, Legendary Tay, man. So. That is done. I completed that. I just was finishing up the promos and stuff today. I got up late. Me and him were asleep. I just been finishing up the promos today and uh, planning on this next video that I gotta finish editing. I got like six videos to finish. I've finished so many. I've shot and edited so many videos in the past few weeks, man. It's been crazy. It's just been hectic, man. I'm just trying to get myself together. So I think I'm gonna vlog again. I just gotta get a new camera because this Canon 6D is specifically for like photos for me. I just you, I just picked up this Canon 6D for photos. I love photos. It's good for video. It's just so heavy, bro. My arm is like, oh my god. My arm. <sighs> Bruh, my arm. Well, I be in the gym too every day now. That's another thing that I changed about my life since the last time y'all saw me in vlogs. I go to the gym a lot. And I eat a lot healthier. So those are two crazy changes for me because I never ever ate healthy. I always ate fast food and shit. The career path that I'm in, like shoot music videos and always on the road and stuff, it's like you're fast paced and you gotta eat fast. But when you're out there, for all my directors, when you're out there and you need to eat something and you're on the go, do not get no fast food. Go to Chipotle or go to Chick-fil-A. I'm sure you're thinking like Chick-fil-A, hell no. Yes, Chick-fil-A, they got grilled chicken nuggets. You can get a side of uh, veggies or a cup of fruit and you can get a bottle of water. That is good for you. That's a good meal on the go. Also, Chipotle. My favorite thing to get at Chipotle is a salad bowl, no rice, black beans because they're good for you, chicken because it's a lean protein, mild corn, and I also get a little bit of hot sauce. No cheese, no guar, nothing, none of that other stuff, man. Just keep it real simple and clean. That's a good meal for you when you're on the go, man. Remember that. I don't get to eat uh, what I want a lot anymore, so I think today we should. Yay? Does that sound good? Should we go? Yeah. Hey man, you heard it right there. We're going to get some tacos and tacos and tequila, man. He said it. Alright, cool. We cleaned up. Now it's time to go get some food, man. But first, let me tell y'all. I know if y'all are dedicated followers to me on my YouTube, you know that I dropped my creative hats. If you don't really know about the creative hats yet, I am Creative Ryan, and I have made my own hat with half of my logo, the creative part. I didn't put Ryan on there, that way it could fit anybody. Anybody can be creative. I didn't want to have Creative Ryan on it, so you're wearing something that has my name. I'd rather it be creative so it's wide open for it. Uh, any type of creative person, but I use half my logo. That's how you know it's my hat. I got black, pink, tan, white, red.
let's go. Come on. Come on, let's go. As you can see, it's hard for me to vlog and do music videos and do all this shit. Now you see why I haven't been vlogging. I have to do so many things. It just kind of is like I don't even feel like vlogging. And I know that you guys want to see what I got going on. Yeah, tell them. Tell them. Tell them. This has been hard for me, but I'm going to get back into it. This camera's kind of heavy. I don't have my certain equipment that I need to vlog, like little tripods and stuff like that. I gotta get my stuff back together, but I'm about to do it again, man. I know y'all have been missing out on the kid. Basically, what I've been telling you is the facts. All I've been doing is traveling and shooting music videos and stuff like that, but I mean, I know that's interesting too. I know y'all wanna see that. I swear I'm gonna start vlogging again. This whole vlog right here is just motivation for me to get back in and start vlogging again and something for you guys to see, you know, let me update y'all what I've been doing, how I'm living, what's going on, my routine, shit like that. So now, every day, what I do is I wake up, me and Ace eat breakfast, we get dressed, I play with him, we watch some TV, we do some stuff like that. I might get a little bit of work done, I might just mess around with some graphics or maybe just a little bit of video editing, not too much. Then I go do something, one, one cool thing with him per day, like go to the pool or go to the park or go out to eat or, you know, something like that. I try to do one thing with so I can get some energy out of him so we can have some bonding time. Then in the evenings, I cook dinner. I try to let him relax, watch a movie, watch TV again. Then I lay him down for sleep. And when he goes to sleep, I plan on getting at least one to two videos edited. Sometimes if I'm not feeling it, I'll wait. I'll skip to the next day or whatever, whatever, whatever. But this is my new schedule and I've been doing it for two days now. <laughs> Before this, I was just getting overwhelmed because I had like 18 music videos to edit. I was traveling, shooting, all types of stuff. And that shit is hard, yo. It's hard trying to shoot. I, I, sometimes I'll shoot five consecutive days. One shoot Monday, one shoot Tuesday, one shoot Wednesday. I have no time to edit. Then I got to come back home, down to travel all the way back to Atlanta. Then I got all this stuff I got to take care of. And people don't realize that shit, man. People are hitting me like, yo, when's it, when's it going to be done? When's it going to be done? Like, yo, 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 where you at? Where you at? What's, what's up? What's up? What's up? Like, yo, people don't realize how busy my schedule is. Not saying that it's a, an excuse for long turnaround times, but shit, for the schedule that I have, I think my turnaround time is crazy. Because some people don't do shit but sit on their ass or play video games or whatever the case may be. Some of these video guys, they just do whatever. It take fucking a month to two months to get your video back. Me, I'm really actually doing things that I have to do, like responsibilities. My son, my bills, my going to see my family, uh, trying to take him to do things because that's what a dad needs to do. Trying to edit videos, trying to shoot videos, travel time. Sometimes I drive to Virginia and drive back. That's an eight hour drive. I can't edit while I'm driving. Like, it's crazy. Some people just don't get it. But I'm done ranting on that shit, man. Let's go get this lunch, man. This dude fell asleep, bruh. No. Your boy fell asleep while I was talking. Your daddy's that boring? Oh my God. I can't believe this. We're supposed to be going to eat. Yo! Yo! Fresh shoes on, cool outfit. I can't believe this. I want to take a nap. Man, I'm about to drive around. I'm about to go do something, man, until he wakes up, man. Now, nah, we're going to go eat. It's going to take like 15 minutes to get where we're going anyway. Atlanta's big. Everything is 15 to 20 minutes away. I can't believe you fell asleep, yo. Hey, man, I ain't complaining. Yes! Yo, but what I said was, uh, can you hear me better? Yeah. All right, so what I said was, um, my boy Tay from uh, Connecticut, he said, uh, I mean, he had, he had tagged me in this fucking post last night, and it was like some dude on Breakfast Club. You know, he was going on about how motherfuckers is lazy, and they don't really be trying to get it. And it was like, they need to be like Prince. It was like, motherfuckers don't know. Prince was a fucking janitor, and he was working as a janitor just to get that fucking studio time money. Just to get money to get and flip it and put it back into the studio just so he can make that fucking music. He was like, motherfuckers lazy, they don't want to work for shit. They ain't really got the heart and the ambition to go out there and, and actually work a fucking job so they can have money to support their fucking career path. That shit real. I don't know. I don't know if it's real, y'all. 
So you think, I don't know. I think, man, bro. I think, what I think about it, I think, I mean, it's true, you do gotta get money. But yo, people don't understand you need time as well, bro. Yeah, but you gotta, that's why you gotta work harder. He said that. He was like, yeah, he was like, if you ain't got time, then you gotta wake your ass up at 4 a.m. and don't go to sleep till fucking midnight. You gotta stay up more hours. You gotta fucking grind if you really want that shit. Yeah, man. If you want that shit, you definitely gotta grind. But yo, bro, you can't, you can't be scared out here, man. I mean, it's scary. It's definitely scary. Yo, quit your job, yo. Yo, if you truly believe in yourself, man, you just gotta do that shit. At the end of the day, like, it's gonna be some scary times. It's gonna be some times where you can't pay for something. Some shit ain't gonna get done, but yo, in the long haul, in the long run, yo, that shit'll pay off. 100%. You just, got, you just can't be scared out here. You can't panic. I, de I definitely believe him, though. Like, yo, if you if there ain't no way other way to make money, yo, go get you a job and hustle. Get that money, y'all, and, and use that shit to fuel the shit that you want to do. Like, say you don't got a camera. Say you don't got um, Adobe Suite, and you want to shoot videos, and that shit is fucking $2,000 altogether to start off. You got to go get that money somewhere. You do. You do got to get that money somewhere, for sure. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you can rent the cameras. It's always loopholes to it, but I definitely believe it's in always, that shit. You gotta, you gotta get, you gotta, you gotta get the shit you need, yo. But you can't, you can't be scared. You can't be scared to quit, y'all. I think people's problem today is they're scared of the obligation they already have. They scared. They already, they already tied themselves into a fucking car payment. They already tied themselves into a 12 month lease. They already tied themselves into a phone bill every month. And people are scared to not make those ends meet, and that's why they can think you don't get job every day, and they never really get to go do whatever the fuck they want to do. You gotta get over the fear of not making that shit happen, and just fucking start doing that shit, yo. Because at the end of the day, when you get scared, that's the hard. That's when you go the hardest, yo. Yeah, that's facts, yo. When you get when you get scared that you can't make some shit happen, you ain't gonna make this money. You go the hardest. You fucking do what you gotta do, yo. And you gotta have that killer instinct inside you to make. Work. That's true, y'all. If you already got a job and you trying to leap into it, I believe that you shouldn't be scared. Fuck no. But I think if you don't have nothing and you're trying to get into something, then you should definitely try to go make some money somehow, some way, any way possible. Shit, I used to shovel snow when I was a kid. You gotta get it, yo. I mean, the only reason I got any of that shit, bro, that's the only reason I got it. I mean, I haven't had a job in like over six years, bro, but like... The only reason I got what I had was because I was fucking around with school, you know what I'm saying? And I would flip them check. I would flip the fuck out them checks. Every check, that shit was going to equip me, yo, because I knew what I could make happen with that shit, man. Bro, I did the and same I'm thing, remember? And then I quit. Right after I got my financial aid check, I quit. Yeah, you, you gotta you gotta you gotta take a risk, yo. You gotta do what you gotta do, man. I had to I You went, gotta do what you gotta do, y'all. Went and got that financial aid check, then I quit school and I bought the camera and now look. Word, yeah, fuck this shit, fuck it, man. If it I wouldn't have got that is, check, yeah. I probably, if I wouldn't have got that check, I probably would have never had a camera. I mean, maybe not right then and there, but I would have had to go get a job and make money or some shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shit crazy. Yeah, so I really wasn't supposed to be eating tacos for one, for two. They didn't even have a kid's menu for A, so that was pretty whack. So, that used to be my favorite place to go eat at, but now I think that's not my favorite place anymore. I gotta go find a new favorite spot. It's gotta be healthy and fit, you feel what I'm saying? We're about to go hop in this pool and shit, so I'll see y'all there. Uh, 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 Oh, 
Oh, we got perfect lighting in here, yo. Yo! Wanna go to the pool? So we're off to the store. Gotta go pick a few things. Oh, this boy's so tired. It's been a long, fun day, right, Bo? But we gotta go to the store after that. Get in the bed, and I'm getting to my edits. So, when I came to the store, this boy done fell asleep in the car again. He's so tired, man. We just been all over the place today doing stuff. He's so tired. I'm tired. I still gotta edit a video. I was about to say shoot. I still gotta edit a video. So, I'm about to run in here real quick just because I gotta get him some food. I gotta get me some food real quick, man. Get back to the crib. Put this guy to sleep, man. <sighs> Alright man, so I tried to get Ace into a cart, let him sit down so I could go in here, but he was just a zombie. So I had to carry him in my arms and push a cart and grocery shop. So that was a hard task. I could not vlog it. I couldn't take the camera with me, so sorry. About to go back home, put these groceries away, get this guy laid down in the bed, and get on these edits, man. Yo. Finally got that little boy back to sleep. Got these groceries, gotta put these groceries away. Gotta get to the edit. I'm trying to get at least one music video done a day at this rate since I'm so backed up. It's been a long day, man. Yo, the whole point of this vlog was to let you guys know that I'm gonna start vlogging again. I know that I haven't vlogged in a minute. I was vlogging, mad people were liking it. I know y'all wanted to see what the stuff I be doing and stuff. It was just a typical day. It wasn't like I was shooting a video of all that behind the scenes stuff and all that cool stuff, but it was still cool. Like, it's still cool. Y'all got to see, you know, me go around, do a couple of things, do stuff with Ace. You know what I'm saying? Just just a regular day, but it was still interesting. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to start vlogging again. Yo, I can't promise you that it'll be every day. I can't promise you that it'll be every other day, but I'm going to start vlogging again. I'm about to get to these edits after I put these groceries away. Hope you guys have had fun with me today, man. Slap the like button if you have fun with me. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. I would love for you guys to stick around. And I'll have more vlogs, more behind the scenes, and more music videos, and more tutorials, man. I'm not going to talk anymore, man. I'm about to close this shit. Peace. Peace.